Once again, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to teach you about so that the middle term in the expansion of 1 plus x to the power 2n is 1 multiply 3 multiply 5 da 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 2n minus 1 2n xn divided by n factorial. So first of all, we have to write here given here given the given data is 1 plus x to the power 2n. So we have to write here 1 plus x to the power 2n. So now I'm going to comparing this data with a plus b ka power n. Now comparing 1 plus x to the power 2n with a plus b to the power n. So what is a here? a is 1. a is 1. What is b here? b is x. And what is n here? and n is 2n clear now for the middle term there is we have to find out that one is odd or even so first of all we have to find out number of terms for the middle term number of terms is equal to n plus 1 n is 2n plus 1 is 1 if we put the value of n is equal to 1 then we get 2 into 1 plus 1 that is 3 3 is odd number clear if we put the value of n is 2 2 into 2 4 plus 1 5 5 is also odd number so we could write here so there are only one middle term clear if there is even number so there are two middle term if there is odd number there are only one middle term you have to remember this now we know that what is the formula of middle term in odd number we know that the formula of middle term in odd number is t n by 2 plus 1 clear this one is the formula for middle term in odd number but if there is even number the formula is changed clear this will be changed what will be the formula t n plus 1 by 2 there are two middle term at that time tn plus 1 by 2 and tn plus 1 by 2 plus 1 if there is a even number in middle term so here is odd number and there is only one middle term that is the formula for middle term in odd number so t is t n the value of n is 2n we could write here 2n divided by 2 plus 1 so 2 to cancel tn plus 1 so formula is always we have to write cnr a n minus r and b r clear so we have to put the value here c n the value of n is 2 n so 2 n the value of r is n we have to take uh, this one only this one is r clear if there is only t n then we have to write here n minus 1 if there is t n plus 2 here is n plus 2 then we have to write here n plus 1 we have to get the value of r by subtracting 1 in this clear we have to get the value of r by subtracting of this for example i'm going to show you like if there is a t n plus 1 what is r here r equal to n clear if t n plus 2 is here so r equal to n plus 1 only we have to subtract 1 here clear if t n is here what is the value of r r equal to n minus 1 if t n plus 3 is here so what is the value of r r equal to n plus 2 clear we have to subtract only 1 n plus 3 minus 1 is n plus 2 t n n minus 1 n plus 2 is n plus 1 we have to write like that so now i am going to put the value of a what is the value of a here a is 1 1 n is 2 n minus r is n clear c n r r is n what the value of b b is x the power value of r is n now we have to solve this is equal to c 2 n comma n 1 the power 2 n minus n is n into x the power n clear so what is the formula of combination so now we have to write here 2 n factorial n factorial divided by n minus r factorial multiply r factorial so 2 n factorial divided by 2 n minus n factorial 
n factorial error. If we have to solve this one, we get this. 1 to the power n. If the value of 1 is 22, it will be 1. If the value of 1 to the power 100, it will be the 1. If the value of 1 is 1000, the value of 1 is always the value of 1 to the power anything will always 1. So we could write 1 to the power n is 1 into x to the power n. Clear. So now to n here. So how could we write? Listen, uh, we could write here 2n, 2n minus 1. 2n minus 2, 2n minus 3, 2n minus 4, like that, 2n factorial. So, first of all, we have to write here 2n, 2n minus 1, 2n minus 2, 2n minus 3, 2n minus 4. The value of 2n factorial is 2n, 2n minus 1, 2n minus 2, 2n minus 3, 2n minus 4, dot, 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 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. How could we write that? If we have 100 rupees, then how could we write here? 100, 100 minus 1, 100 minus 2, 100 minus 3, da 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 we could write here if we have the value of if we have the rupees 2n then we have to write 2n 2n minus 1 2n minus 2 2n minus 3 2n minus 4 da 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 six five four three two one clear if we have 100 rupees if we spend 100 rupees then how much we get 1 now the value of 1 so we could go from this value to 1 always now 2n minus n equal to n factorial we could write here n factorial n factorial multiply 1 into x to the power 1 is x to the power n clear so now now i'm going to put the value 2n 2n minus 1 2n minus 2 2n minus 3 2n minus 4 dot dot dot, dot 6 5 4 3 2 1 into x to the power n divided by what is the value of n? n we have to subtract minus 1 n minus 2 dot, dot how much we get 3 2 1 like that into the value of n factorial is n factorial why should we do not do anything to this data because we need that x n n factorial we need in the proof so we could not do anything to that data now let's cut it down n n cancel 2 n minus 2 n minus 2 cancel by 2 how could we cut it down like uh, sorry n minus 1 and 2 n minus 2 is cancelled by 2 n minus 2 and 2 n minus 4 is cutting down by 2 how could we cut or how could we cancel if 2 n minus 2 is 2 if we get 2 common then what should we write here n minus 1 and uh, that is n minus 1 so n minus 1 and n minus 1 is cancelled by 2 similarly 2 n minus 4 if we get the value of 2 or common 2 we get the value of n minus 2 divided by n minus 2 how could we get by cancel 2 clear so let's do it same thing so n minus 1 2 n minus 2 is cancelled by 2 n minus 2 2 n minus 4 is cancelled by 2 3 to the 6 2 to the 4 1 to the 2 everything is cancelled by 2 so what should we write here 2 2 2 2 there is almost 2 here 2 2 2 2 many 2 so we have to write 2 to the power n because 2 2 2 2 2 so we have to write 2 to the power n what is that here 2 minus n 2 n minus 1 2 n minus 3 dot 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 5 3 1 5 3 1 x to the power n divided by n factorial that we have to write and there is nothing in the base clear so we have to write from this uh, right side like 1 3 5 dot 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 2 n minus 3 is in dot dot 2 n minus 1 to the power n x n divided by n factorial proved we have to prove like that clear so this one is very very important for your examination point of view so you have to solve
and if you like this video then like it comment 